When I think Eurocom, I usually think great gaming laptop with a really unassuming case. It's funny, but if you see all these videos online of supercharged family sedans beating sports cars off the line, it's a bit like that. Eurocom's laptops look like the kind you take with you from meeting to meeting at the office, but then you'll be in the break room 30 minutes later playing Fallout 4. This is the Eurocom Monster 4, a 14-inch laptop that runs neck and neck with whatever today's games require. It's a smaller laptop, which means that you don't get a number pad, but if you don't need one, it's all good. A mid-range price point means that you'll get good bang for your buck and you'll never look back. Eurocom also makes their laptops highly customizable so that you can upgrade or swap out certain components here and there. Now that you've seen a visual look at things, let's take a look at how it plays. During many of these videos, peer up at the top left-hand corner to see how many frames per second the games play at. Let's switch gears and check out Bioshock Infinite. Here's a look at Soldier's Field. Interest is a prophet having a bunch of carnies and carousels. The place is themed to equate children with national service. You mean the military? Train up a child in the way he should be. you read that? You know, I'm sure you want to see how it performs in battle, so here's me running headfirst into a battle just so you can see how good it looks and how bad I am at this game. Alright, last is Fallout 4. This is running on low settings, but it still runs at 60 frames a second. I don't really get into anything exciting here outside of wanting to show you how the backgrounds look, and really what the water textures look like. Oh yes, of course, I did try to make some time to play Surgeon Simulator, but I forgot all the controls and somehow I got my fingers stuck on that thing, so just forget about it. That's the Eurocom Monster 4, now available online at bestbuy.ca. I'm Matt. Check plug-in for previous Eurocom laptop reviews and, of course, more to come.